Hey guys, how you doing? Look at this shirt. This looks like a 1930s uh, album cover or sleeve or whatever you want to call it. And uh, I'm going to tell you about this in a minute. This is a modern shirt uh, for Nat Myers, a musician. Uh, if you hadn't heard, the uh, person that was behind the guitars we make, Tammy, passed about five days ago. Um, if she was okay when she went, it was kind of unexpected, but um, she had Cornelia DeLange syndrome. And you will see me, I think, start up another channel to talk to people who have children with Cornelia DeLange to kind of look back on my experience because there's things you can look back on and say, hmm, maybe this, maybe that. But I am here uh, because another artist that we built a guitar for has come forward and they're they're they keep coming i'm getting videos out of ireland and mississippi and everything it's, it's difficult but um i do need to tell you i don't want to like go jesus on you here look if you where's chick flick teal pointer probably morning but if you need me to go Jesus on you, you probably got a big problem, son. Anyway, um, Tammy was not able to, I'll just jump right to it, commit sin. She wasn't cognitively able to decide things like, you know what, I'm going to make fun of somebody, I am going to hit somebody, I'm going to gossip about somebody, I'll put some ducks up on the dais. <laughs> Nothing like that. So Tammy went out of here with no baggage, and that's good. And, and that makes me think about what a better person I am because of her. I know you're sitting there going, oh, you're a terrible person. Well, I was a much more terrible person with the square root thing or whatever you want to call it before Tammy came up here. Anyway, so this evening we are going to hear from Nat Myers. Uh, Nat Myers plays some of the most authentic blues music from the 30s and the sharecropper music. And I was able to get with him. I swear, where is my pointer? There it is. There it is. So I'm going to give you a link. We did an interview with Nat, and he was playing, accompanying Tammy on a guitar. So Tammy was functional, and I'll explain that more as they go on. But they spent some time together one day up by Calabasas, and you're going to hear Nat talk about that. So Tammy was left-handed, so I set up a couple guitars. This is a Gretsch Honey Dipper. It's a steel body guitar and it's left-handed so this was Tammy's guitar this is one of Tammy's guitar Fred Wallachy signed it and did the setup on it thank you Fred um, but I was able to see Nat yesterday when he came through Van Ventura California cultural capital world on his way to Europe and we had some time and that's what this uh, video is about we're gonna see Nat play this guitar. He's left-handed as well. And then we're going to talk a little bit about this guitar here. This is Tammy's archtop. It's got a Florentine cutaway. It's strung up left-handed. And believe it or not, this was stained by uh, sap from a eucalyptus tree in the city where I work. These things drip eucalyptus, red sap called Kino, and it makes them structurally strong. I don't want to get into all that. I think if you would Google my name, you'd find something about tree structure and palm trees or whatever. Did you know that Tammy's name is Tamara, which is Hebrew for date palm, which is how I made most of my money in life. So when we built this guitar, like, this coin up here is Phoenician. It's got a palm tree on it. It's 2,000 some years old. There's another one on the back that helps you figure out where you're going to put your finger. But this was Tammy's arch top. 
And so what's going to happen is we're going to have a ceremony. Uh, Kendra, Tammy's older sister, came back from Vegas where she's in law school. She's going down music law. So all you people out there that have known us forever, that might come in handy for you later. Uh, but she said to me, you know what? The kids that went to school with Tammy, they, they need something where they can honor their classmates. The rest of it could have happened over the internet because this guitar thing blew up into something big. But anyway, Thursday night, this Thursday night, we're going to be at the high school Tam went to. And we are going to have, I don't know what they're going to call it. Because there's things like vigil and celebration of life and all that kind of stuff. You know what? This is not going to be a sad thing. There was nothing sad about Tammy. And uh, she's in a great place right now. In fact, I asked her, the last thing I asked her was to tell me that that place exists and that she's there and it's real and it's good because if you're me out of everybody you want to know that that's true but anyway um students of of the school district you're going to have an opportunity to hear a little bit more about tammy than you probably knew her world outside of this town was huge you're going to start to see that and then what's going to happen is i'm going to bring these guitars in and i'm going to want you to sign them wherever you want. Now we're going to hang them up in a room and and that's going to help me. It's very difficult right now for me uh, and, and the, the rest of the family. I, I don't even want to get into that. You can only imagine. Um, so, yeah, don't expect the, the typical uh, um, wake ceremony or memorial where everybody's sobbing. I'm not going to put Kleenex in business, trust me. And I think Tammy had an allergy to people putting candles out by crying on them. So expect something <laughs> very different in a way that only Tammy and her daddy could put together. So listen, let's, um, let's break away from this now. Let's listen to what Nat Meyer had to say. Uh, about Tammy, and let's listen to some music he had to play on, uh, on Tammy's guitar. All y'all out there, I literally could not believe the outpouring that we've had since Tammy passed. Y'all are wonderful. I have no idea when I started making these, I made Tammy a guitar so she could show her potential outside of not being able to talk. But I look back and wonder how devastated I would be right now without all of Tammy's music friends reassuring me what a wonderful person she was because I, like a lot of people, got a long ways to go. Thank you. Those of you that are local, I hope you'll come and see what kind of a mess we got going on Thursday at 4.30. And uh, take it away, Nat. What's up, y'all? This is Nat Myers. Uh, I'm hanging out with Ken from Palmero Guitars over here in Ventura, California. And I'm playing on Tammy's guitar here. This uh, little honey dipper of a Gresh. Just messing around with it, I understand why she liked it so much. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Tammy, Tammy's a left-handed player, just like yours truly. And, Southpaws, he's got to keep united, you know what I mean? So I'm just going to play a little bit. Uh, yeah, this one's for Tam. Two of us, world be 
give a little, lose a little. Gotta get the blue little bit, but baby, that the boy you love. Probably about almost a year ago, ain't that right? Just about a year, maybe a little year and some change. Um, over in uh, Calabasas, and uh, it was such a wonderful time. And I appreciate being part of the memory of Tammy and what she becomes after. So, thank you so much, y'all. Thank you. 
It's a nice guitar, man. And his guitar's nice. 